Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. The latest Patch Tuesday cumulative update for Windows 10 KB5011487 is now available and started rolling out on the 8th of March 2022. And that's available for Windows 10 versions 21H2, 21H1 and 20H2. And once the update is applied, your OS build will be now, if you are running version 21H2, 1.1044.1586. The 0.1586 stays the same for all the versions. And if you're on 21H1, that'll be 1.9043. And if you're on 20H2, that'll be 1.9042. Now, the Patch Tuesday cumulative updates are mainly security updates. And this month, the Patch Tuesday uh, update includes updates that address and fix 71 uh, security vulnerabilities found in Windows 10, Windows 11, and also all the other Microsoft products and services. And it also includes uh, fixes for three zero-day exploits, which means um, that a, a zero-day exploit means that that is already exploited in the wild, which means it's currently active. So it's important to check that your system is up to date, just even if it's just for the security aspect and side of things. And to do this, as always, we just head to our settings menu, update and security, and the Patch Tuesday cumulative updates will be downloaded and installed automatically onto your device. And once it's installed, you can just restart to apply the update. And if you're interested, you can come back to view update history where you'll see the update listed cumulative update for Windows 10 version 21H2 KB5011487. Now, just on a side note, um, as mentioned, this is a security update, but if you did not install last month's optional update, which rolled out on the 15th of February, KB5010415, which had uh, two new minor add-ons and numerous bug fixes, those add-ons and bug fixes will be bundled into this update, KB5011487, and I will leave a link down below to that video where you can go check out those little add-ons and numerous bug fixes if you're interested that if you didn't apply that update will now be bundled into this latest patch tuesday cumulative update now kb5011487 does have a an improvement which rolled out for both um which was available in the um, in this windows 10 update and also in the windows 11 update and that um addresses a bug that meant onedrive users would still find some data on their PCs even after a proper reset which is not very good so as an example if you were getting rid of your computer to sell it or give it away and you had done a hard reset to wipe all your data there were some residues of OneDrive um, uh, files still found on some PCs and that bug has been addressed um, with this latest update 5011487 and then also uh, the update um, if you installed the earlier updates, only the new updates contained. Uh, if so, if you installed the other optional update, as mentioned, only uh, the security updates will be bundled into this update for Windows 10. And, there's, and then there's also been updates to the servicing stack, which is uh, responsible and is the component that installs Windows updates onto your device. And then if you, for whatever reason, can't install the update through Windows Update or you're having problems in that regard, you can just head over to the Microsoft Update Catalog where you can download and install the update automatically. So that's more or less uh, what's new for KB5011487. As mentioned, it's a security update that fixes 71 vulnerabilities, three exploited in the wild. And then obviously from last month's optional update, it has some add-ons and some optional bug fixes. So thanks for watching. And I will see you in the next one.